Hello? 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 I want to get your reservation. I'll be happy to help you with the reservation. Thank and you. And when are you looking to come into the hotel? Tonight? And how many nights do yes. you stay? Good night. Is it just for one day? Yes. And how many adults, how many children? For 10 people. For how many? For 10 people. I'm sorry, could you say that again? Yes. For 10 people. 10? Yes. Okay, how many rooms do you need? Uh... And what is your job? I'm sorry, say that again. Who are you? Who's this? May I have your name, please? I can barely hear you, ma'am. What is your name? May I have your name, please? You have ten people. Yes. So do you need, is there two people in each room? Yes. So you need five rooms? Yes. Okay. And it's Thank a you. Night stay. Yes. Okay, I'll be yes. happy to take a look at availability for you. Thank you. Have you ever stayed at the Kyoto Grand before? No. Okay, well, I'll still be able to assist you. Okay, um, thank you. Uh, I'm just going to give you some information about us while my rate slows. Can I get your name? Thank you. Marlene. Marlene? Yes. Thank you. So we are located right in downtown Los Angeles. Okay, thank you. Are you coming in for business or for leisure? Uh, no. Just for leisure? Yes. We're in easy access to the major freeway and a short ride will take you into Hollywood. And okay, thank you. And the clerk would be more than happy to help you make those arrangements. Thank you. Now, check, checking for your room rate. Do you want yes. a, one bed in the room or two beds in the room? Uh, no. One bed? Yes. Okay. I do have a standard queen room available. Okay, thank you. And the standard, this room will include breakfast for two. Uh, parking. Are you sure? Sorry? Are you sure? Am I sure what? Yes, I am. Oh, yeah, okay. because I need to give the information to the resort. You got this information before? Yes. Okay, so I have a standard clean available then at 189 per night plus tax. Is that what Thank you, you. Were told before? Yes. Okay, so you want to book five of those rooms? Yes. Okay. And Thank can you. you spell your, can you spell your first name for me? Did I spell C A M P B S M Boy E L L? And your first name? John Kimball. John. And are all the rooms going to be reserved by John? Yes. Okay. And do you have an email address for your confirmation letter? No. Okay, no problem. I'll just Thank you. You'll need a pen and paper, though, for your reservation number. Okay, thank you. Okay, can you hold one second, please? No problem. Okay, thank you. Thank you. And can I get the address that's associated with your credit card? Uh, Home address? No. I am at work. Is it a work address? Yes. Say, can I have that address? No. No. Are you sure? Uh, yeah, I need I need an address to put on your profile. Uh, no. No, thank you. 
I know can hear you that well. Okay, but I can't book you into the hotel. And how your address, please? And how your address, please? Oh, yeah, because I need to give the information to the resort. Yes. Hello? Yes? Yes. Thank you. Can you spell your name, please? Say that again, I'm sorry. Can you spell your name, please? My name is Tanya. Thank you. Can you spell your last name, please? We don't give out our last name. Okay, thank you. And I'll need an address to book you into the hotel. No. No. No, thank you. Okay, without an address, I can't book you into the hotel. Are you sure? Why? Because the address has to match your credit card. You want to try again? Sorry, say that again? You want to try again? I am at work. You need to supply me a credit card to book you into the hotel. You don't know your address? Which department is that? Which number are you calling from? Hello? Yes? I want to get the reservation. For 10 people. Yes, if you need to make a reservation, I can do that, but I have to have John Kimball? the address. I need the address that goes with your credit card. No. I, uh, okay. Okay, okay, can you hold one second? Okay, if you don't supply me an address, I cannot book you into the hotel. Yes. Okay, can you hold one second, please? Sure. Thank you. Hello? Yes. Yes, I'm here. Okay, thank you. And have your address, please? Yes. Yes, I need an a I need an address. Okay, can you hold one second, please? Sure. I live over the 59th Street Bridge. Hello? Yes? Yes. Okay, do you have an address for me? You want to try again? I live over the 59th Street Bridge. I live over the 59th Street Bridge. Okay, thank you. Hello? Yes? Yes. 
Okay, I need an address, ma'am. I live over the 59th Street Bridge. Yes. Ma'am, I, I need an address to put on your file. Excuse me? I live over the 59th Street Bridge. Yes. Ma'am? Yes. I need an address to go with your credit card. If you're not going to supply me an address, okay, I need to disconnect the call. Okay, can you hold one second, please? Sure. Hello? Yes? Good afternoon. Right? For how much? Let's hear it. Hello? Are you speaking to me, ma'am? Yes. Okay, I need a credit card address. Okay. Street Bridge. I live over the 59th Street Bridge. You live under the 69th Street Bridge? Yes. Okay. What's your physical house address? That's baloney. It doesn't make sense. So you are okay, responsible for this. Ma'am, all I need is your address for your house that matches your credit card billing statement. If you're unable to provide that information to me, I cannot look you into the hotel. You're going to be unsuccessful because you are a thief and a scammer. Okay, well, thank you very much right? for calling the Kyoto Grand Hotel. You have a nice day. Yes. I will kill you, and then I will kill myself. Right? 